Hi, my name is Stefan and this is my new project Hevatar. Hevatar is my new power metal project and uh, it came to my mind while I was bored during the Bancanto life break in 2012. So I finally remembered that I've been a guitar player and a lead singer before I founded Bancanto. And so I thought it'd be a good idea to team up with some friends and record a German power metal album. Here it is, it's called All My Kingdoms and will be released by the end of February in 2013 in, in Germany and uh, the following weeks uh, in the whole world. The first song is called Replica and uh, the main idea behind Hevatar is uh, uh, to take some of the greatest classical composers and uh, classical compositions and to include them uh, into um, power metal compositions. So I try to imagine uh, how it would be sitting together with Johann Sebastian Bach and Ludwig van Beethoven in a rehearsal room and writing power metal songs. And I guess you know the, the main theme of the first one, here's Replica. The second one is called Abra Cadabra, and uh, it's about uh, Paganini, who's been uh, called the sorcerer because he uh, was a quite fast violin player. And uh, we took uh, one of his, um, his famous caprices um, as uh, the guitar solo for this one. The third one is called All My Kingdoms, so it's the title track of the album. It's a mid-tempo one uh, and it's featuring some great drum parts of Jörg Michael and I'm very proud to have him on this album. He's a great drummer and he did a great job. called Elysium at Dawn, inspired by Für Elise from uh, Ludwig van Beethoven. And it's an up-tempo one, it's a heavier one, quite fast and quite aggressive, uh, with, a, with a big chorus as well. Yeah, the fifth song is called Long Way Home and it's featuring some, some really big background uh, choirs performed by uh, my Van Kanto bandmate Ross Thompson and Olaf Senkbal and Haki Hackmann. Uh, both I got to know during the Blind Guardian choir session 
and it's not a secret that I've been always uh, inspired uh, by Blind Guardian, so I'm very proud of this one because it's it's featuring really, really big wires. I love it. Yeah, the next song is called Born to Fly. It's a, it's a heavy one, heavy, a really power metal song. And uh, it's featuring a very great guitar solo of my uh, friend Sebastian Schaaf, who also did a great job on this album. Luna Luna and it's featuring the Mondschein Sonata by Beethoven and um, we try to play it during the intro um, with a bass guitar so quite special uh, transforming a piano part to the to the bass guitar but it sounds uh, really heavy and really cool. The longest one on the album, it's called The Look Above and it's about 11 minutes long and, um, uh, and we, we have everything in it. There's ballad parts with piano and there's really um, up-tempo parts with heavy double bass drumming. There are big choirs, there's an orchestra playing along and I think in this song we have everything that I love uh, with power metal. The Look Above. Thoughts are moving on Consolation comes and waits for you So here is that sad song Yeah, and the last song of the album is called To The Metal, it's a very special one uh, and I think it's important to, uh, to leave something open for surprise, so I would be very glad if you, if you bought the album and just uh, not just download it and give it a chance, it's uh, another power metal album, like there are about 1000 power metal albums every month, but this one is special I promise. Okay, see you all, bye bye.